What's up guys, name is Ray and welcome to another Genshin Impact video. So I am a bit late on this because I was busy over the course of the day, but I don't want to miss out to go over the Lost Riches event and for its event details. Yeah, before we go into that, I just got some leaked information real quick that I want to share with you guys. Yeah, so this one was just posted a couple of minutes ago on Twitter. We're talking about this new Resin Pass that just got posted uh, on the PlayStation. So, so it is actually not leaked. It is officially posted on the PlayStation. So, so I just have some Chinese screenshots over there. What I assume is it will cost the same amount like the Welkin Moon Pass which gives us 300 Genesis Crystals and 90 Primal Gems for the next 30 days if we want to buy this. So this is not too interesting if you're free to play, but if you're like a low budget player, this can be a very good opportunity for you guys. So upon purchasing this resin pass, you will get 60 original resin immediately. And over the course of the next 30 days, you will get an additional 40 original resin when you log into the game. Yeah. That's like already did. I do not know when this will come into the game. I don't know exactly how much it will cost, but I assume it will cost as much as the Welcome Pass. And yeah, so because it just got posted um, on the PlayStation Store, I assume that it will come also out very, very soon. Yeah, so keep an eye on that. Maybe if you want to consider to buy some resin. All right, so let's get back into the Last Riches event. I didn't touch the event today, so I want to do this in the video all you have to do as always is press f5 if you're on the pc then you have the lost riches event right over there where you can view and it will lead you right to stone gate where you can talk to all man so this is what i want to do right now All right, so I just talked to Uman, so let's go over the event details. So we have two treasure areas for the first day. Uh, in six hours, for me, this will be the next day. Uh, we will get two more treasure areas. Then there are those special treasures uh, that we can get. So what I assume is that we will get some additional primal gems, maybe Mora and other things over the special treasure. Um, it will be unlocked tomorrow i guess with those two new areas and yeah over the course of the next week we will get um two treasure areas each day so yeah let's take a quick look at the shop and then we hop into the event so the event shop of course because this is an event in patch 1.2 we do not need resin at all because they promised us that in their um, developers letter so we get a lot of very important things, especially Heroes with Primal Gems and Mora. These three things are very important. If you go into the later state of the game, you definitely uh, want to have those. Mystic Enhancement Orbs also very, very nice because you're kept uh, from the Blacksmith. So very good. Important thing is if you buy one of those mini Sealies, you won't be able to buy one of the other ones. So if you buy, for example, Rosé, then you are not able to buy Dayflower or Kakuma. Yeah. Uh, so far, I think they don't have any additional um, effects. So it is just visually. So just pick the one that you like the most. But keep in mind, you won't be able to pick the others. You will be able to pick all these. And the earliest you will be able to get one of those mini series will be in two days. So overall, three days if we count the today. All right, so yeah, let's do a quick clear for the event. I think I would do a, um, I will speed the run a bit up, but you can watch it if you want to. If you don't want to watch it, then it's all right for me.
all right guys so i just cleared the event it took me like a little bit more than five minutes now um even though if you're very slow like me uh having like troubled to look around the map find those treasures it won't take longer than five minutes um yeah uh we get 100 about 120 of those iron coins per day so means that we will need at least three days then we would have 360 of those iron coins to get us one of those mini series but you can um, also just purchase anything that you like to because we will get every of those rewards anyway as long as you collect all the iron coins yeah hope you guys did enjoy today's video if you guys do so like comment and subscribe it would help me out a lot and i'll see you guys next time if you guys want to see more Genshin Impact content, videos should pop up on the screen right now. Make sure to check them out and I thank you for your support.